What's up, YouTube? In the van today, I think it's the first time we've done one in the van. Uh, another day in the life video, but it's across two days. Um, as we go into the Christmas period, there's the obvious job in there. I've only filmed one of them because you will be bored with the amount I've had to do. A frozen cotton and pipes. Um, general of a, of a general plumbing, shower change, tap cartridge change on a kitchen tap, and a boiler combi swap for a landlord. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, why not? If you don't enjoy it, hit that thumbs down. And drop me a comment for what videos you want to see in the future. With it coming up to the Christmas period, the videos probably will slow down until January and then we'll go full chat flat out it again um, with hopefully two a week. Thanks for watching. So we've got a dripping mixer tap. I've isolated the two isolation valves under the sink there. As you can see, and open the tap up, make sure it's shut off. There should be a little cap in here, but it's missing. Undo the screw to try and get the head off. As you can see, she's stuck solid. After a bit of perseverance, it snapped. Nice one. So the spline has snapped inside the head. Undo the actual cartridge out the body of the tap. That's what we're going to be replacing. So we're going to have to sew, I've just sewed, put some WD-40 on that, try and sew that. I'm not going to punch on my sewing, he's not on key, I'm just trying to tap it out. I should be sponsored by WD-40. And hopefully, the tap it with this tap kit all different new cartridges in except that one which need to replace sad boy it's gonna be that one well <coughs> WD40 didn't work so try warming it instead all this for the cartridge Water back on. Managed to use one of the cartridges out of the cartridge kit I've got the side of me. Lovely. Replacing this bar mixer, completely getting rid of the rain head, just because we don't use it. She wants the slide rail in the centre, but using one of them screw holes up there, so it's not drilling anymore. Isolated the water, check, check it's turned off. Undo the hot and cold connection on the back, as I am doing. It's all like a rusty scale inside the uh, pipe up to this. It has got a scale reducer fitted to the cold mains, but I'm not sure how old it is. They do need replacing. Spin off these old chrome covers. I'm going to replace them with the new round ones that come with a new shower. Just checking the connection is solid there. You see the scale and stuff inside the um, filters of the shower.
Yeah, splash straight in my face. I won't be doing that again. Make sure you got your two washes for your hot and your cold. Hot on the left, cold on the right. Try and tighten up each side equally. Don't just dog up one side and then try and get on the other. Do them both at the same time, really. Gotta remove this monstrosity now. Your two washes for your hose. One for the head, one for the hose connection to the bar of the shower mixer. Probably teaching people to suck eggs, but if you're a DIY watching this, you might not know how to do it. You'll need to hand tighten them. No need for any tools for that. Yeah, I'll see ya. Next one, this pipe is dripping here, which is your condensate pipe. Needs a bit of pressure in actually. But that is dripping, so. Boil a few kettles, not to full, and we'll uh, see what's going on. See if we can clear that. What I'm going to do with this one is because it's such a long run, badly hold the camera. Cut it off and pour the kettle from here. I can't do it on a pretty shit size. Pour the kettle in from down here and push it out that way. It's just started to uh, dump it water. It's not like it's in there, it'll be in that leg under the door, which is most open to the uh, elements on this one. So, this is a combi swap we had on Monday. To be fair, it needs a complete repipe. It's a bit of a mess, but it's a landlord's job. And we're just here to get it back on. Look at that condensate pipe. North. We're upgrading that through the wall. Someone beat through with a hammer. Condensate all finished now. It's got a bit of plaster work to patch up here. That's going to be hard, but we'll try and do that. Drain off on our return. Obviously, we've got to drain off on the flow there if we never needed it. Upgraded the condensate through the wall. Blue's finished. It's just finished its air purge mode. 
We'll get it commissioned and cleansed out.